Welcome students. If you're wondering what this video is all about, it's to help you get familiar with Tutor.com for U.S. military families. Or if you've used it before, it's just a refresher so you can get the most out of this awesome program, especially right now. This will be a guided step-by-step -step session where you can pause the video while you log in and use Tutor.com military for yourself. So let's get going. Step number one is to log into your specific tutor.com program. You have a custom website that you'll use to log into your account. Eligible military connected students can access tutor.com by going to www.tutor.com slash military. You will either click sign in at the top right corner if you already have an account, or you will create a new account. If you need to create a new account, select your family's branch of service and then follow the steps to create the tutor.com slash military account. We basically just need your first name, an email address, which will be your username, and a password. Then use the drop down boxes to finish up. Let's go ahead and pause here so you can either sign into your tutor.com slash military account or create a new one. Press play when you're ready to move on. Welcome back. Let's go on to step two, the pre-session survey, where we ask just a few simple questions to get started. You should see something like this when you log into your tutor.com account. Yours might look a little different, but the important stuff is the same. You should see some tabs across the top. We'll talk about those later. But for now, go ahead and click the Get a Tutor Now button. Welcome to your tutor.com dashboard. Here are those simple questions we need to get you connected to the best tutor for you and your question. By the way, did you know we have over 3,000 tutors? That's a lot of brain power. All we need to know is your topic like math or science, your subject like algebra or chemistry, your grade level, and a question. That could be something sort of general like help with graphing equations or something really specific like a question or a problem off your homework assignment. You can also see there's an option to choose a tutor who has a microphone. That is not required and for today we won't check that box, but you can use that in the future if you want to talk with your tutor out loud. You can also attach a file if you have a document you want to show your tutor. Once we fill that out, we hit the green Connect Now button. Now before you do this, take a look at the classroom with me. This is what the online classroom looks like. You share this interactive whiteboard space with your tutor so that everything you write or draw can be seen by the tutor and they can write and draw too so that you'll see it. You'll also chat in that text box back and forth with your tutor or if you chose voice earlier, you can also speak with your tutor. You have the option to add text to the whiteboard if you want to type instead of draw. You can also use the tools on the left side of the screen and put in formulas, shapes, symbols, and lots of other things. Or add a new whiteboard and maybe put some graph paper over it if you're working on some sort of graphing equation. And speaking of graphing, we also have a built-in graphing calculator if you're working on a complex calculus or physics problem. There's also a text editor, which is like a word processor, so that you can work on brainstorming or the early drafts of writing assignments one-on-one -on -one with your tutor. Let's pause here so you can check out all of the topics and subjects available. When you're ready, go ahead and fill in the topic, subject, and question that you want to work on. Once you've done that, you can connect. Take your time and be nice to your tutor. They're real people that want to help you with your homework and assignments. Press play after you're finished with your live tutoring session. Hopefully you got to see what the classroom looks like and work on a question or a problem with your tutor. Remember, you can use this program anytime, day or night, 24-7 to get help at home, at school, or on the go. Before you go on with your day, let's take a minute and go over the other features available to you through your tutor.com account. First, remember that you can always connect to a tutor on demand anytime you have a question or need to review or work on a paper, but you can also plan ahead and schedule a session with the tutor.
you should also try our essay drop-off feature. This is great for any writing assignment, whether an English paper, a college admissions essay, a history paper, or anything else. Just tell us some information about your assignment, tell us when it's due, upload the paper, and you'll get expert tutor feedback returned to your tutor.com account in less than 12 hours. Feeling confident? Try your hand at one of dozens of practice quizzes and see how you do. If you're unsure about an answer, you can click Discuss with a Tutor and the topic, subject, and question will be loaded into that short form you saw earlier, allowing you to connect to a tutor right away. Last but not least, Military Connected students can also find SAT ACT Essentials powered by the Princeton Review. This is a set of self-paced prep materials to help you get your best score on these admissions tests. You'll find practice tests, high quality videos, and drills in specific areas of the SAT and ACT. Track your progress and get ready at your pace. And finally, you also have some cool features under the My Account link. You can find previous sessions stored here, which you can review as videos or a written transcript or even ask the same question again. You can see if you favorited that awesome tutor you just worked with, and also find stored documents in your tutor.com locker. And that's all there is to it. The last step is to not get bogged down with your homework. Try tutor.com at home, school, or on the go for all of your classwork questions, review, test prep, and more, and then get back to your real life.